Origine Maria and I'm a graphic artist, printmaker and illustrator. I work in the city of Sobirans in the province of Barcelona. I present the artwork Banbori Matsuri with which I got a third prize in contest Hommage de Troyes 2022. It is dedicated to the writer Ichiyo Higuchi, who was Japan's first professional female writer of modern literature. In stories and poetry of author, national and folklore traditions take a very important part. One of those traditions is a lamp Latin festival. There are various festivals described in Ichiyo Higuchi's books, Teenage Bind for Tops and Child's Play. These stories inspired me to draw a Banbori Matsuri Latin festival in Japan. As references, I used old traditional ikiwe woodcuts and also took inspiration from Latin pictures. My artwork is done in etching, one of the oldest printmaking mediums, made on copper, steel or zinc plate. It was invented in the 15th century. Etching is truly fascinating and complicated technique. First of all, I had to polish the plate and cover it with resistant to acid waxy ground. So, I could smoke it later. After this essential process, I was able to begin the most delightful part. Of course, it's drawing. All of the details in prints are made with a tiny needle for etching and were beaten in acid afterwards. The last and most responsible part was printing. The final result of the print expresses the world's inequality. The composition of drawing is cut up by the katana in two different parts. Right one with a young boy who is dressed in a gorgeous suit, yet his face looks sad and magnificent clothes, seems alien. The left one, with Bonbori lanterns, looks bright and hopeful, but doesn't connect with a boy's life. High hopes of a young man that in the future will be destroyed by the poor family region. His life is destined to fulfill unfair judgment of the society. I believe Ichiyo Higuchi's books are still actual nowadays because of humanity questions she was raising, the ordinary people's tragedies like Nobuses and Midorises from Child's Play that still seems so real. It was an honor to illustrate her book and thank you for Aida for such a high evaluation of my work and opportunity to show it.